The Mexican Revolution was a time of great social and political upheaval in Mexico. It was a period of intense violence, in which bandits, rebels and revolutionaries rose up against the ruling Porfirio Diaz regime. As the revolution raged on, many of these bandits would become national heroes, celebrated for their bravery and determination in fighting for justice and freedom. The revolution began in 1910 with the goal of overthrowing the long-standing dictatorship of Porfirio Díaz. Díaz had been in power for more than three decades, and his regime was characterized by corruption, economic inequality, and political repression. The revolution was sparked by a number of factors, including the rising frustrations of the Mexican people, the increasing influence of foreign powers, and the growing strength of the Mexican labor movement. In the early days of the revolution, Many of the rebels were little more than bandits, robbing banks and trains to fund their fight against the government. However, as the revolution gained momentum, many of these bandits became more organized and began to fight in more conventional battles against government forces. One of the most famous bandits turned heroes of the revolution was Pancho Villa. Born in 1878 in Durango, Mexico, Villa was a notorious bandit and outlaw before he became a revolutionary leader. He fought against government forces in a series of battles throughout northern Mexico and became known for his daring tactics and his willingness to take on much larger and better equipped armies. Villa's most famous battle took place in 1916, when he led his army of rebels across the border into the United States, attacking the town of Columbus, New Mexico. The attack left 18 Americans dead and brought the United States into the conflict on the side of the Mexican government. Villa was eventually defeated by a combination of U.S. and Mexican forces, but his legend lived on. Another famous bandit turned hero of the revolution was Emiliano Zapata. Born in 1879 in Morlos, Mexico, Zapata was a farmer who became a revolutionary leader after his land was seized by the government. He led a group of rebels known as the Zapatistas, who fought for land reform and the rights of indigenous peoples. Zapata's most famous battle was the taking of Cuautla in 1911, in which he and his army of rebels defeated a much larger government force. Zapata's motto was land and liberty, and he fought tirelessly for the rights of Mexico's poor farmers and indigenous peoples. The revolution was marked by intense violence on both sides, with government forces often resorting to brutal tactics to put down the rebellion. The rebels, in turn, frequently resorted to banditry and guerrilla tactics to fight back against the government. The revolution came to a close in 1920, with the ousting of Porfirio Díaz and the establishment of a new, more democratic government. The revolution had a profound impact on Mexican society, leading to land reform, the recognition of workers' rights, and a greater sense of national pride and identity. In conclusion, the Mexican Revolution was a time of great social and political change in Mexico, marked by the rise of many bandits who would become national heroes. These rebels fought bravely against the corrupt and oppressive government of Porfirio Díaz, and their struggles helped to bring about a new, more democratic Mexico. Their legacy lives on today, as Mexico continues to strive for social justice and equality for all its citizens.